Hi everyone, this is Brendan here. I'm currently in China right now, so my internet speed is not very good. Um, it took quite a while to actually get uh, got clashed to start loading, and um, luckily I'm able to do my war attacks. So um, as what I told you guys, we are doing a troll war right now. So we will proceed on into looking at some of uh, my clan mates attack. So uh, first of all, you can see uh, we have scored a number of zero stars. Uh, I'd like to show you guys uh, some of the attacks which uh, will begin with uh, this particular raid on number 17, Cha Cha, done by Mad Dog, who scored uh, 2% as you can see. Uh, he brought along with him 110 wall breakers, um, focusing at only one point of the base, which uh, he deployed his heroes and eventually deployed all his 110 wall breakers at the same spot, uh, luring out even the CC and destroying almost uh, all the walls that's in the way. And uh, he proceeded on to spam out all his remaining wall breakers, as you can see what, what he's gonna do. And it's a <laughs> really pretty funny raid, but uh, it won't be as funny as uh, the next one that I'm gonna show you. As uh, the, the next guy, he actually did it in, an, in, an, in a more amazing style. So we'll proceed on to the second raid that I'd like to show you guys uh, in our troll war. So uh, the second raid uh, is done by uh, Ghostman31 on uh, number 41, Sir John. So as you can see, it's a Town Hall 7 base. Uh, he has brought along with him 10 Goblins and uh, 85 Wall Breakers. So we see what he's going to do, luring out the Clan Castle is a level 4 Dragon with his Goblins. Uh, you drop, dropping his Wall Breakers around the whole base, uh, just having some fun. At the same time, um, just uh, deploying all the bombs, activating the bombs, making the King just run around trying to attack the Wall Breakers. So it was really a pretty funny uh, replay when I watched it. But nevertheless, it is uh, very difficult to score even one star, definitely. So we are just having fun for this uh, particular war. Um, so I will show you guys another of my uh, sub accounts attack, uh, which I did on the number 5. So uh, it scored a uh, 34%. So my troops combination is very interesting. As you can see, I got like barbarian, archers, goblin, giants, wall breakers, uh, almost every single thing in the uh, whole entire army camp is filled with various troops, but uh, definitely not those big troops. I do not want to use all those strong and heavy troops. Um, it's a kind of a long read, so we will speed up the uh, replay. So as you can see, I tried to load out the CC and trying to trying my really best to do a, a one star event even. So I decided to kill the CC first uh, using a Valkyrie and a balloon. To kill the wizards so at this point of time i was uh, trying to kill the archers because i didn't want them to disturb my uh, archers that i'm going to deploy at the corners right now so as you can see uh, i decided to attack uh, from the right a bit to clear up the st uh, structures on the right so that i can get a bit of percentages so i focus on the left dropping my cc which i didn't really bother about what troops i had deploying my hawks my healers my balloons everything just go in uh, giants going in, goblins going in, and even the wall breakers and king and queen. So using all my spells, dropping a, a jump spell, trying to get the king in, and then eventually raging the, the king and queen, trying to go get them into the core, kill, killing the uh, opponent's king and queen. Uh, dropping a lightning spell on the queen just for fun, and then after that just uh, cloaking my queen. At the same time, uh, raging them, trying that, trying to get them into the town hall, but with a low level. King and Queen is definitely impossible to do such thing. Um, but yeah, so this raid is can say practically over with me using just one archer trying to steal as much uh, dark elixir as possible as I just want to throw this face as much as possible. So I'm not too sure what uh, our opponents are thinking right now. Maybe they are all just confused with uh, our actions. So I uh, also like to show you guys a live attack right now using my current army. Sorry, I would like to show you guys uh, 17 archers max archers with uh, my king and queen cc is just practically rubbish i just ask a request for anything that throws so people give me wall breakers barbarian archers so that's really fine with me so with that said let's proceed on with the attack um and looking at this space i actually scan through this space i've decided to attack from here so let's see we will deploy in a very unique manner just deploying the healers first making sure that they don't heal anything or whatsoever because uh, if there's no troops for them to heal they will not start healing uh, drop the king there drop the queen here drop a cc there hopefully the wall breakers will break through the wall for me but nevertheless there's still a jump spell just in case uh, the wall breakers didn't succeed in doing so i'm hoping that the king will actually go in um, taking out the opponent's queen 
at the same time lowering up the CC so that I'm able to take them out. Um, as you can see, the CC inside is a dragon. Wow, oh, my king is gonna die with the infernal locked onto him. So hopefully, uh, they can do something about it. Uh, I think I better drop the rage right now. Drop a healing spell to heal my troops also at the same time. Um, I'm preparing um, the heal, the free spell so on the inferno so that it doesn't kill my queen. So hopefully my queen will be healed back at this point of time. Yeah. So as you can see, uh, I don't think I'll be able to score a 2-star. Um, as some of you might still remember, infernos actually prevent a healing on your troops. So I need to focus on the inferno, making sure that uh, my queen do not get damaged by it. So now as you can see, she's taking out the town hall. Hopefully she's able to take out the town hall before she actually goes down but as you can see she's like a bloody tank over there uh, recovering her HP and like never dying it's like an immortal queen so we will see how it goes I don't think I can score 2 stars now it's like 30% and as she goes towards closer to the inferno once it's locked onto her the healers cannot heal her and she will just go down right now so with that said uh, this raid is and has ended so um, I don't think uh, we will be able to win this war but nevertheless, it's just a troll war, it's just to have some fun. So, um, yeah, so that's it for the clan war. So, um, as for my video upload, I'm not really sure when I can upload this, but I will upload it as soon as possible, hopefully uh, when I'm back, because uh, um, China doesn't allow people to use uh, YouTube, at the same time, uh, Facebook or whatsoever, they have actually banned uh, various sites. So, I don't think I'm able to upload this as soon. Uh, but rest assured, I'll upload this as soon as I reach back to Singapore. So with that said, I'd like to thank you for watching my video and clash on.